Welcome to Exam Party. Our topic today is building materials. In this video we will 1. Discuss the term building materials 2. Identify various types of building materials and 3. Learn about the uses of building materials. A building is a structure that is designed by architects and built to provide shelter for human beings. It could also be a building or edifice, an enclosed structure with a roof and walls standing permanently in one place, such as a house or factory building. Building materials are materials used for construction. Each material has different properties, such as weight, strength, durability, and cost, making it suitable for certain applications. Many naturally occurring substances, such as clay, sand, wood, and rocks, even twigs and trees, have been used to construct buildings. Common building materials include the following concrete, steel, wood, wrought iron, thatch, glass, mud and clay, sand, and so many others. Buildings are identified by the materials used in building them. Examples include 1. Mud buildings. These are erected with loam clay soil, adequately treated. Mud is soil, loam, silt, or clay mixed with water. It usually forms after rainfall or near water sources. 2. Brick building. Bricks are molded from dried mortar. That is a mixture of cement, sand, and lime, and at times clay burnt in kiln. There are two types of brick buildings. That is, the sun-dried bricks and the fire burnt bricks or red bricks. 3. Sandquid building. The primary building material for walls of single-story buildings such as houses and schools is cement and sand. 4. Wood building. These are buildings done with log, timber, plywood and many others. The uses of building materials are 1. Sand. This is the most common building material. The two types of sand used in building construction are soft sand and sharp sand. 2. Gravel. This is the constituent of concrete used in building construction. There are two types of gravels, namely pebbles. These are small stones excavated from pits or rover bales. 2. Granite chippings. These are chippings of blasted granite stones generally collected in grade sizes. 3. Cement. This is a finely powdered manufactured substance consisting of gypsum plaster or Portland cement that hardens and adheres after being mixed with water. It's an important material in building construction. 4. Wood. Wood is a natural product that forms the trunk of trees and is used as a material for building construction. They are used to produce wooden doors and windows and are also used as roof and ceiling structures. 5. Leaves and grasses. They are not commonly used nowadays, but were good roofing covering materials in the past. 6. Plastic and ceramics. These are used in sewage pipes for draining waste. What are the uses of buildings? Buildings are used for the following purposes. 1. Shelter. 2. Convenience. 3. Storage. 4. Privacy. 5. Protection. 6. Knowledge. 7. Comfort. 8. Security. Buildings are of many types and could be for commercial or residential purposes. A building can also be identified through its construction design. Examples include bungalows, duplexes, detached and semi-detached, huts, high-rises, skyscrapers, and many others. 1. Bungalows. These are buildings that are only on the ground floor. 2. Duplex. This is a compact story building roofed on the first floor and only designed to locate the sitting room, dining room, kitchen, and the guest room with the conveniences on the first floor. 3. Detached. A detached building has walls and roofs independent of any other building, with open space on all sides as specified. 4. Semi-detached or terrace building. These are a series of unit buildings along a line joined together with common dividing walls. 5. Skyscrapers. These are very tall buildings with more than 10 floors and over 100 meters in height. 6. Hot. This is a small unit and usually round in shape and covered with thatch. Types of buildings according to uses. 
Buildings are generally classified according to their uses. These are 1. Agricultural buildings 2. Commercial buildings 3. Residential buildings 4. Educational buildings 5. Government buildings 6. Industrial buildings and 7. Religious buildings We've come to the end of this lesson. Answer the following questions to assess your knowledge. 1. Explain building and building materials. 2. List five types of building materials. 3. Explain the uses of each type of building materials. Thank you for learning about building materials with me. I'll see you in our next video. Bye!